I'd say I'm, I'm really proud to be a healthcare professional working in prison. It gives you a unique and rare opportunity to really support prisoners and patients in, in ways that you wouldn't get in the community. And I think if I was to sum up from one word, I would say it was inspiring. I'm inspired to come to work. I enjoy getting up, coming to work and yeah. We're trained slightly in mental health, but to have the practitioners, the support, mental health, everything, the nurses, we couldn't function as a prison without those. One of the things that strikes you about prison is, is you can have imagine what the people inside a prison might be like and, and you know, how kind of um, perhaps difficult and challenging they may be to work with. But actually my experience is that they're, uh, they're very, very receptive to the uh, work you're trying to do with them. Often this might be their very first or, or kind of one of the only examples of being in a really caregiving environment they might have had. So that can be really, I mean, it can be quite emotional, but it's also quite, a, a, you know, a, a, one of the positives about working there. It's really rewarding to maybe see someone at the beginning of their journey when they are at this point of crisis to take them through that stabilisation of their mental health up until their release and just the difference in their mental state due to uh, this fantastic multidisciplinary team. It's just, it's really good to see. We welcome people to come into our roles that maybe have never worked in a prison before and we, you know, we all have to start somewhere within um, prison healthcare. So we offer a lot of training and support to develop both clinical practice, so looking at how therapy or treatment can be delivered in that unique environment, but also that kind of peer support and that network that we have within uh, prison services to support each other. You know, we're all in um, a very similar boat within the different uh, establishments we work in, particularly similar challenges, but also particular strengths. So coming together um, is a really big part of working within prison healthcare in Chief. The best things to me about my job is you just don't know who's going to come through the door next. Um, we're lucky, I don't know whether that's the right word, but we're lucky to meet the people that we do, work with the ladies that we do and be part of their journeys and listen to the stories that they have to tell about us. I think for us, you, you see that change in people once you've worked with them, you can really make a difference, which I think would be like, it just helpful for your role and makes you want to come into work because you know that you can make them differences. I think it's important to always put the person first, the person you're working with first, and consider their individual needs. Everybody's different. Everybody's in prison for different reasons. And there's been something that's led them to come in there and we always have to be mindful of that. It's a really interesting place to work. It can vary day to day, even hour to hour. Um, things can change, but it's a real sort of chance to make a difference to people that you're working with that perhaps, you know, a lot of people wouldn't give a chance to, and it's it can be very re rewarding. I made a complete change from like acute stroke work to mental health with no experience and was welcomed with open arms and I've just really felt so supported and the roles just developed and developed. So I would say anyone who really wanted to kind of come and have a chat about that or see what it looks like, there's like untold opportunities within my prison, within the whole of health and justice prisons to come and see because it's just a really like untapped world where I think there's lots of people could come and join us and really enjoy it. Speaking to staff that work in the services, you know, arranging visits to come and visit the establishments, talking about our future agendas and, and, and kind of developments that we've got, I think would be the first step. Um, there's lots um, of, you know, literature and research that's going on about prison healthcare. Um, and I think within Tuve, we are ahead of the trend with that. And I think um, we would be more than happy to speak to people about um, how we, we envisage uh, prison healthcare to, to go forward.